Hi everyone. I wanted to show you what I have been loving lately. Um, back in September, I decided to sign up for a subscription bag or subscription box, whatever they're called, but like the Ipsy, the Birch box, and what it's called, those kind of things. And I decided to sign up for the Ipsy makeup bag. Um, well, I should say like makeup beauty bag because I obviously love beauty. I love everything um, like that. And I thought what better way to get to know new products, new things, than so signing up for free products to come to my door every month. And so it's just um, $10 a month and you just sign up give them your address, your credit card and everything, and then they charge you $10 at the beginning of the month, and then they send you your bag at the middle of the month. And I think it's great, I've been loving it, and I've gotten two bags so far. I got September Glam Bag and October Glam Bag, and I just wanted to show you what's in them. Maybe if you're thinking about subscribing to one of these, uh, maybe this will give you a little bit of an insight on what you'd be signing up for, and will help you uh, make a decision. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so when you get your um, glam bag, they email you like, you can like do things beforehand to like see what's in your bag. Like you can add friends and you can have like people subscribe or not, yeah, they subscribe like under you and then you can earn points. I'm brand new to it, so I haven't figured all that out yet, but I will leave um, some instructions or maybe like my link down below if you're interested. Um, but then they send you an email saying like, oh, your glam bag is on its way, it gives you tracking and everything. Once it arrives at your house, it, I should have saved it, I'm so mad, but it comes in a mailer that is bright pink and it's sparkly and it's so cute and you get so excited, you're like, yay, because you know that's what it is. So it comes in this sparkly pink mailer and then it comes with like a little card that has like hashtags and stuff on it. Um, and it just tells you like share, rate, like whatever. But then this is the glam bag from September that I got. It's just like a brown bag and I, I love this bag. It's so simple and then it sits on the top um, first I and then I got this on the outside of it. So this is my first product. It's the Garnier um, Full and Plush Voluptuous Blowout Treatment. And I'm so mad at myself because I forget that I have this product. Um, so I haven't tried it yet, sadly, but I'm really excited to. Maybe I'll do a review about this when I actually use it. But it's like a full-size bottle. It's not like a little travel size or anything, so I was really happy about that. The thing that I had in my bag was the, it says Ipsy, and then it's partnered with NYX. It's an eyeshadow palette. Um, the number one, I guess. And it's super cute packaging has a little bow just compact like little I love it, it comes with a little brush and then it comes with three shades like a light taupe color a brown sparkly and then a black is it sparkly it's matte so a black matte sparkly brown and a sparkly like taupe nude color and I actually use this palette for my family photos this year that's it's so good it's so pigmented I'll just swatch them for you so I think they're really pretty. This one, the light color didn't turn out good because I had that in black before. There you go, it's more like a gold champagne. Um, those are the three colors, super pretty. And I, like I said, I used this for my family photos this year and I loved how it turned out. They looked so good. Queen of the Fill Elizabeth Mott Tinted Eyebrow Gel in Light Medium. And, this is the shade, the brush and everything, and I like the brush, I like that it's not round like the Maybelline Brow Drama, it's like a big huge ball, and then I get it everywhere, and I don't like it. So I actually do like this product, I haven't been using it very much lately because um, I've been doing my eyebrows really dark, because I'm just into that for some reason lately, but I do like this to fill in like on a more natural bit, I just throw in some, I'm like drawing all <laughs> I just throw in some gel, throw this in, and this is a really good product. Next I have the Bayberry Naturals Rose Hip and Hibiscus Moisturizer. It says 81% organic, 100% vegan, no sulfates, no phthalates, no parabens, no artificials, fragrances, or dyes. 
so super good. Um, just a little guy. <gasps> Sad. Um, I like this a lot. I don't use it every day just because I want to have it like when I travel and stuff so I don't have to, I'm just going to use it as lotion I guess. Um, I don't use it every day because I want to be able to have it when I travel or something. I can just throw it in my handbag or throw it in my makeup bag so I don't have to take like my big huge like clean and clear moisturizer thing. Um, I do use it some days just to change it up a little bit and I've really liked it so far. It makes my skin really smooth so once again, great product. And the last thing for the September Glam Bag is the, okay, these names are killing me, Chastique, Chastique Lip, Matte Lip Crayon. It's so cute, the packaging actually looks like a crayon. Um, pop it off, and it's like a matte pink color. Um, this is like my go-to lip color. I love this. It's very easy. Um, I don't need a lip liner with this. I, I keep this honestly in my purse. I just throw it on when I need some lip color. <laughs> Allergies. Next, in the October glam bag. This was the October bag. Like, I would pay $10 for these bags. So, you're paying $10 for, like, the bag, and then you get, like, five products for free, I feel like. I think the bags are adorable. I use this September bag. I put all my brushes that I use daily in here. So I fit like eight brushes, eight to ten brushes in here to zip it up and this like stays with my like everyday makeup. So super great. I haven't found a use for this one yet, but it's super cute. Maybe a cute little clutch or something if you're going out. But let's get into this bag. I love this bag. This bag is like the score for me. First. I will start off with the things that I haven't used yet, sadly. Um, so first I have this Pretty Eyes Automatic Lip Liner. And like I said in the video before, I'm not a huge eyeliner person. Hold on, there's a thought. If I see it again, I'm gonna kill it. Okay, there it is. Got it! So proud of myself right now. Hey, I got the fly. Okay, that won't be like buzzing around me. Not the best fly liner. Don't use it a ton. So I was happy that I got this. I was like, oh, push me out of my comfort zone. I'm gonna use it. And then I looked at the color, and like black eyeliner is enough out of my comfort zone. They sent me a purple eyeliner. Second off, I got a nail polish, and it's called Dose, and it's just this cute little thing. Um, it's in a purple shade as well, so two purple things. Gosh. Seriously, I can't open the nail polish. There's another fly. Oh, maybe that one was outside. There we go. And it's a pretty, just a normal purple. Um, my nails are done right now, so I haven't had a chance to use this yet either, and that's why I haven't used this yet. Pretty color, I'm sure I'll use it before the year's up. I don't know the brand. It's called Meet Matt Hughes. I think it's from The Balm. Committed, I don't know. It's in the shade Committed, I think. These are all the things, I'll just read you the whole package. Meet Matt Hughes. Long lasting liquid lipstick. Knitted. The bomb. So, yeah. Um, and it's a really pretty pink color as well. It would be something that I would like to go to. Um, I did wear this one day and it ended up cracking a little bit because it was matte. So I would suggest like pairing this with something, but it's really pretty. There it is, swashed. It's almost like that provocative color. Okay. Now, for my two most favorite things that I got. I am so excited for these products. I don't even know which one to start with. I'll start with this, because I'm more excited about the other one. So, I got a Nourish Organic Food for Healthy Skin, Pure Hydrating, Argan Face Syrup Serum, and it's Apricot and Rose Hip for normal to dry skin, and that's what I have. And when you sign for Ipsy, they like ask you a ton of questions, like what products you like, 
what you want to try, like what you like. Do you like hair products? Do you like makeup products? Do you like lipsticks? Ash cube, everything. Ash cube, the color of your eyes, color of your skin, normal to dry. So it sends you like products that you can actually use. Um, this, <laughs> I was expecting to be like a moisturizer, which I don't know why because it says serum on it. So I like used the product we mentioned that because I did it and then I was like, oh, put this on. And I like poured it out and it was like an oil, like a serum, like a serum. It's clear. Put it on. It smells so good so good um and it makes my skin the softest i've ever felt so beautiful but i pair this with this product so this product is what i'm most excited about from this glam bag like this i will probably buy a big one of these when i'm done because i love it um it's called scrub me nice and gritty body scrub and it's um it says scrub me good for all skin types enriched with raw sugar, organic coffee, coconut oil, and cocoa butter simultaneously exfoliate and moisturize. And it's a coffee scrub. I'm so excited. I, I've been wanting to try one of these, but I was like, oh, I don't know what to buy. I don't know what would be good because I have really sensitive skin. And so I was like, I wanted to bring me out. Like, I know it's all natural, but I just don't know. Like, debating. And then Ipsy just comes to the rescue and sends me one. And I... I like to smell it. I made my husband smell this and he about threw up. And I think it's because it's really strong coffee smell and we don't drink coffee. And I made my mom smell it and she like, I was like, oh my gosh. But it smells, it smells like coffee and like vanilla to me. It's probably like the cocoa butter and stuff that I told you was in it. But yeah, it's, my, I think it's my Balanced Guru Organic Farm. A C two. I don't know. I'm not even gonna try. Just to keep. Oh my gosh. I thought that was open still. Gave me a heart attack. Just a cute little coffee scrub. And I love it. And it turns my face really red. And I, so I use this first. I'm talking so much about this. I use this first on my wet skin. I just. I mean, it's a body scrub, so you're supposed to use it all over. But I have just used it for my face so far because I'm like what I was most excited for. Use this on my face, wash it off, and then I apply this. And then I don't put makeup on for like an hour or two just because my face feels so soft. So that is my little sneak peek and insider into the Ipsy Glam Bags. And I hope this was full of information for you and helped you decide if you're interested in Ipsy Glam Bags or I hope you just enjoyed learning about more products like I, like I have learned about from this bag. And, um, if you want to see more of the videos of what I get in my glam bag monthly, just let me know, know down below in the comments and we can have a little chat. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!